Hi, I'm Gia Nicolaides. Here's your morning brief on the coronavirus. It's now day eight of the national lockdown. Last week, Friday, the country went into lockdown to reduce the number of infections. Last night, we got the latest figures. We now have 1,462 confirmed cases and five deaths. There are, however, 45 recoveries. There's also been an update on the revised regulations for the lockdown. Government will be using the geolocations of people's cell phones in the fight against COVID-19. So, health department tracer teams will be allowed to use the phone locations of people who have tested positive to track down others that they may have come into contact with. But government is adamant this will not violate South Africans' privacy. Immediate families and close friends will now be allowed to travel to other provinces to bury their loved ones. Informal food traders can now trade, but they must obtain a permit from their counsellors before setting up shop. You still cannot buy cigarettes. The police minister, Becky Kreile, says no province in the country is allowed to go against the lockdown regulations with regards to the sale of cigarettes. He said this in reference to the Western Cape government's decision to lift the ban on the sale of cigarettes in that province. Repatriation between countries will now be allowed, which means the minister or a person designated by him may allow a person to enter or exit the Republic for emergency medical attention for a life-threatening disease. Globally, the number of infections has passed the grim milestone of 1 million. Both the World Health Organization and the World Food Programme say they're deeply concerned about the impact of lockdowns on food security in Southern Africa. Countries have been urged to keep the borders open for food. And while South Africa still has 13 more days to go before the lockdown is complete, it seems that there are more cars on the roads this morning here in Johannesburg compared to a week ago. People have been urged to stay at home and only leave to get essential supplies while maintaining social distancing. For this and more, go to ewn.co.za forward slash coronavirus.